and it is November 7th. And yes, there is already concern about a turkey shortage for the holidays, but it goes beyond the turkeys. Actually, News reporter John Carnelli found out why we could all be paying a lot more to sit down for our holiday dinners. Brett Rizzi owns no bull prime meats in Albuquerque. He says there's a turkey shortage this year. So it started back before COVID started, but it's continuing now because of the labor shortage and other reasons on raising turkeys. And because of the shortage, those wanting a turkey on their holiday table may be paying more. I think that turkey prices are going to be 25 to 30 percent more than last year. And as you get closer to Thanksgiving and the shortage is still in grocery stores and meat markets, it may be a little more. Rizzi saw this coming. He saw a shortage with beef, chicken and pork much earlier in the year. That's why he loaded up his holiday order far in advance. Normally you would order turkeys in September or October, but this year for some reason I thought, well, I better order early. I ordered in March and April all my turkeys and I'd ordered three times the amount that I did last year so I could take care of my customers. Rizzi says it's not just turkeys. Whatever your meal, whatever your tradition, he says get it now. I think that being prepared for the holidays, get their turkey early, get your hams early, even hams and prime ribs, I think it's going to be a problem with the shortages that we, we, we saw. I'm John Cardinelli reporting for KOAT Action 7 News. According to ABC News, around 40 million turkeys are sold for Thanksgiving nationwide. <laughs>